coming to you from RGIS Studios. I am Anicia Antoine and this is your Midday News Brief. The second cohort of security personnel has commenced training under the Ministry of Education security course. Following a number of break-ins at various schools on the island, Minister for Education, Innovation, Gender Relations and Sustainable Development, Honorable Dr. Gail Rigabat, indicated that the safety and security of the individuals on the school premises are of utmost priority. The minister explained that the necessary steps would be taken in that regard, including the training of individuals to serve as security officers at the various schools on island. Commandment in charge of the Police Training Academy of the Royal St. Lucia Police Force, Inspector Lacinta Daisy Dolo, indicated that selected individuals were considered most deserving to participate in the course. The training is at a level of a Special Police Constable SPC and commenced on Monday 22nd of July and will be held over the period of two weeks. On the hills of a successful carnival season, events company St. Lucia is gearing up for what is promised to be an exciting Roots and Soul Festival. The St. Lucia Roots and Soul Festival is dedicated to musicians who are setting new trends in reggae, conscious hip-hop, Afropunk and R&B with performances, masterclasses and encounters between artists and other acts in the music business. The event will feature a mix of international artists and local artists, including reggae legend Taurus Riley, world-renowned reggae group UB40, and St. Lucian artist Showing Dupes Bryce. The Roots and Soul Festival will kick off on the 23rd of August at the Ramp and will continue on Saturday 24th to Sunday 25th at the Pigeon Island National Landmark. The Ministry of Health and Wellness, in conjunction with the National Emergency Management Organization and the Pan American Health Organization, recently facilitated a mass casualty management workshop for first responders. The mass casualty management workshop was conducted with the view of increasing the capacity of individuals who respond to incidents of mass casualty. According to the World Health Organization, a mass gathering is an organized or unplanned event where the number of people attending is sufficient to strain the planning and the response resources of the community, state or nation hosting the event. Pahos Country Program Specialist in St. Lucia, Tessa Strode, indicated that the workshop is a timely one given the increase in natural disasters over the years as well as increased mass crowd events taking place in St. Lucia. Instructors who were recently trained at the Mass Casualty Management Workshop were properly equipped so as to be able to train others in the management of mass casualties. This has been your Midday News Brief. Thank you for watching.